indie music video. Never heard this song before. Should I have heard this? Is this popular? As you travel away, is that Beck? Yes, I love Beck. This is the guy that won that award that no one knows. Oh, this is intense already. What is that? <laughs> this is so hipster, I feel like. It's artistic, I'll give him that. What? <laughs> Why was there an astronaut? I'm so confused right now. Like, you just want to sway to it. It's kind of a good song, though. I'll give him that. I like the song. Okay, now I really need to look into this new album. <laughs> I really like this. Wait, why does he have to the kids? I'm enjoying this. It's about death, I'm pretty sure. Well, I think it is about death. Was that a dance move? This is so sad. I'm sure there's so many deep meanings behind this, but almost all of them go over my head. Hi. What is happening? No, don't give him flowers. Run, run. Don't kill the little girl. And now they're pushing chairs on the stone. Best part, okay, that just made the entire video. What just happened? I'm confused. So any idea who that artist is? No. 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 Zero clue. No. Who was it? Beck. It's Beck. That is Beck. Well, this artist has been making albums since the mid-90s. Oh. <laughs> That's a new song. And it's a shame that most of the kids in my generation know, don't know about him. And he's one of the most famous artists of our generation. All right, now I feel dumb. Why have I not heard of him before? We're now going to play you some of his earlier work. Okay. Oh, yeah, I've heard this song. The guy's back. School guy's back. The plastic eyeballs. Shoot. I know this. Never heard this either. Oh, man. This brings me back. Oh, loser. So oh, it's Beck? Oh, man. Do you know that song? No. Not not even a little bit. <laughs> Sounds really familiar. I've heard this. Where it's at. Yes, I'm so happy right now. Bottles and cans, or just clap your hands, or just clap your hands. Where it's at. I've never seen any of these music videos, but I've definitely heard the songs. I wanna jam out now. <laughs> I have no idea what I just watched. A little bit of a Dalek at the end there. Was that Jack Black? Was it seriously Jack Black? <laughs> oh, okay then. Okay, it's a fridge hopping it up until it explodes, but it's okay because it's back. Like my head is having like a music gasm right now. He's playing a broom. and I, I actually really like it. You guys look really disappointed in me. <laughs> so do you have any idea who he is now? No. No. I know who he is from the songs, but I don't know his name. Yeah, that's Beck. This is Beck. Like Glenn Beck? Beck, that's what it was. I've heard his name come out of my dad's mouth. Yeah, not ringing any bells. Have you heard of him? No. Nope. I have heard of him, yeah. Yes, just recently from the awards. Didn't Kanye say something? Kanye was like, oh yeah, he didn't deserve something. How do you know Beck? I've known about Beck for a little while. Um, he made the song Loser. He was kind of one of the original alternative members. He's, he's brought out the quirky side of alternative. How would you describe his musical style? What? Strange. Sounds like indie. Eclectic. An acquired taste. His older work was so much more like upbeat. His newer stuff seemed like more like folky. Versatile. I think he, he can adapt to what's what's good and what he likes at the time. He hadn't made a major album since 2008, but he made this new album in 2014 where the first song was from, which won Album of the Year at the Grammy Awards. He won Best Album of the I have no idea who he is, and he wins Best Album of the Year? And he beat out Beyonce and Pharrell and Sam Smith and more. Are you surprised that Beck won 
album of the year over those artists? Yeah, kind of, because it didn't really, there wasn't really a big hype for it. I'd be surprised, because it's nice to see that people still support him over time. I don't really care for pop music, so, you know, when I heard Beck one, I was like, yeah, awesome! I'm completely surprised. Usually the Grammys go on, like, what's really, really popular at the time. I had no idea who he was until the Grammys, and not until what he won his Grammy did he get number one album. So I feel like Sam Smith and Beyonce were a lot more deserving just because they worked just as hard and they actually sold a ton of albums. Just because it's pop music doesn't mean it's bad. But when he won, Kanye West came on stage. No, are you serious, again? Yes, I saw that. That's so mean of him. He has no right to go up there and take away this guy's moment. I think that Kanye is a horrible person. <laughs> And he almost said something and then he walked away. Later, he said that Beyonce deserved to win, though he also admitted he hadn't even listened to Beck's album. <laughs> What's with him and Beyonce? Jay-Z should be legitimately concerned. She can make the worst song in the world and he will say she deserves to win. Well, that's kind of funny though. I feel like he's, he's like the world's biggest troll. It annoyed me. Because, like, if you, if you really haven't listened to it, how can you judge this? Oh gosh, I'm such a hypocrite, because, like, I'm thinking the same way. I've never listened to Beck's full album, yet I'm criticizing him. Okay, like, me and Kanye are both wrong. Like, I feel like we shouldn't have an opinion on it until we've actually heard Beck's full album and then decided. So Beck's album sold a lot of records and was even on the charts. But despite the success of this album and it winning a Grammy, it's not getting played on the radio. Yeah, they always play like the same four songs on the radio. Even though he used to be played on the radio all the time. Why do you think the radio is so narrow? Because the radio feels like they only should play the relevant stuff. I don't know, I wish I knew the answer. <laughs> Most radio stations aim towards a younger audience. The radio is good, but then it's bad because it only plays like the top like 10 songs and it plays them over and over and over. We stopped listening to like music because of the music and we started listening to it because of the artist. Like we don't listen to Taylor Swift's new song because it's good, we listen to it because it's Taylor Swift's new song. The radio plays music that matches our society today and our society today is focused on ass. You have no idea how disappointed I am with the teens my age. They only stick to like the pop radio stations because you know, it's all catchy and they don't have to think about it. You know, as long as it sounds decent in the background. Just explore it on your own. Look at like who you like, then look at their predecessors. Look at who they, like what inspired them. And what do you think about the idea that this is going to happen to you when you get older? There's gonna be major artists that you know that you'll grow up and teenagers will have no idea who they are. Yeah, that's sad. I know. I I didn't think about that, and I'm really not looking forward to it. I understand my mom so much more now. Oh no, that's so weird. And you guys are probably all mad, huh? You're like, what do you mean, who's back? It does bother you to a certain extent because some artists make such an impact on your life, and then people in the future aren't going to get exposed to them at all. It's kind of our job to show them. These are all our good artists. So finally, are you now going to check out Beck's new album? Um, realistically, Probably not. I'm sorry, Beck. I, I support you. You know, it sounds cool, but I'm. it's just not my thing. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, most definitely. I think I seriously am going to sit down, watch all his YouTube videos, probably download his album, because he sounds really good. I like it. I honestly thought that this was like one of his first albums. Like, I had no idea. So that's so weird to me. I'll probably listen to it now. Have more respect for Beck. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching this episode of Teens React. Bonus footage from this episode will be coming out on the React channel, so make sure to subscribe there. Bye. Goodbye. Look up some back. Just do yourself a favor and look him up.